relief with freedom hello guys this is shindel thank you so much for dropping here in my channel today it's freezing here guys and i am here sharing with you some thoughts for today and my thoughts is we can live with a feeling of full freedom in this life why i am sharing this with you guys this very moment about freedom this is my share with you today about freedom because i read it in the scripture and i am sharing it with you because many of us are struggling with depression struggling with difficulties anxiety loneliness and you name it We all have struggles to face in this life journey. It is what it is. It is a part of our life journey that we all have to face struggles in this life. And all through these struggles, guys, how can we really feel freedom? Of course, we can feel freedom with the right mindset. Guys, for me in my own experience, Yes, I experienced depression. Yes, I struggle. Yes, I have a lot of problems to face every day as a single parent. I am not problem free, but guys, how I live my life. Even this is just very very difficult. I did survive life with the right mindset. And guys, I am sharing this with you really because this is a huge thing for me and I think if I can help others through my experience, it helps me through it and keep moving forward. Because I know I am not alone. Each and every one of us have faced struggles in this life journey. Problems, it cannot be avoided. No person is problem free from one person to another. We all experience different kinds of struggles. And all of this, out of all of this, we must feel freedom. It is very important that we can feel deep inside us that we are free. We have freedom in our life and how can we really feel freedom in the middle of the struggles in the middle of the difficulties we can only feel freedom when we invite God in our life guys again i have to remind you that this is not about religion it is about your spiritual communicating your inner feelings to god just knowing believing have faith in him that he is there within us therefore it is very important that we can talk to him every day that we can acknowledge him communicate with him every day and that feeling of freedom will just come into yourself when you can acknowledge that god is with you all the time and how can we even acknowledge that for me i invite him every day in the morning as i pray thanking him for my life i am breathing i am alive so much to be grateful for acknowledging him every day that he breathed his life on to you you're not breathing today without the goodness of god without the greatness of god we are not here we are not alive because he created us because goes of love. He loved us, he will provide us and he is there for us. So therefore it is very important don't praise on yourself of difficulties, don't praise on yourself of being enslaved of those anxiety, depression, loneliness whatsoever you're struggling right now. Do not enslave your slave yourself with that guys. Remember You can have a full freedom in your life by just changing your mindset, by changing your thoughts, acknowledging that God is with you all the time. Guys, believe me or not, 
every day. I have to call unto him when I am driving, when I am in the toilet. I have to acknowledge him that he is with me so I can feel safe and secure. And by that, when we are feeling safe with ourselves, when we are feeling secure with ourselves, We feel freedom. We feel free. We are feeling great with ourselves when we can acknowledge God within our heart. I want to talk with you guys about those people Moses brought out of Egypt. They were in a journey for about 40 years. It was hard. It was not a problem-free journey. Moses led the people out of Egypt because God commanded him to do it. I am sharing this with you guys because all through those difficulties, all through the struggles, they make it through because they acknowledge God is with them in that journey. They feel the freedom. It is important, guys, to feel freedom in our day-to-day -day life so we can have the clarity of mind, so we can think the right decision, so we can reach the right decision in every situation of our life. To reach that right decision, guys, you have to confirm it to God. You have to call to Him. You have to talk about it to Him. And it is, you know, in the church, there is confession. And it is the same, guys. You cannot just depend on that you have to go to church to confess. No, really, feeling freedom is about releasing those feelings from within you, verbalizing it, saying it loud again and again, communicating with God. And it is the same when you are going to the church. You're going to the church to confess, right? There is a certain day for that, going to the church on Sunday to confess. It is the same. You can't talk with yourself in front of the mirror. And by that, you feel good with yourself. You have the freedom. And when you feel that freedom within yourself, you feel good with yourself, you feel secure with yourself, you feel safe. Guys, insecurity, guys, in our life, it's really not a good feeling. And it reaches to a bad decision when we are insecure. When we are not confident enough, we reach a bad decision. We do such things which is not supposed to do but when you can acknowledge that God is in control you have freedom in your life when you know you you feel free you feel freedom in your day-to-day -day activities in your day-to-day -day life because freedom and self-confidence goes hand in hand to have that good feelings within you to feel secure to do the right thing and to believe that you are really doing the right decision for yourself so To feel that freedom, guys, acknowledge the greatness of God. Acknowledge that you are not alone and you are never alone because God created us with a partner which we cannot see. But the point here is the belief. It's your faith in Him. So how can we really feel the freedom in our life? Simple as that. Pray a lot. Meditate a lot. Come unto Him in a word of prayer, day after day. Silent yourself. At least 15 minutes in a day, guys. You can spend that to yourself. Silent yourself. 15 minutes. And have just to think of Him. Thanking Him for all the good things He has done in your life. Embracing the moment that you don't feel stressed you feel secure because you feel confident because you're feeling good with yourself and through all these things guys you are living your good life you're living your best life when you can feel the freedom freedom from depression freedom from the fear of lack freedom from the loneliness freedom from the anxiety 
it is a must. We have that kind of feeling. So we are not going to struggle more. That life is hard. Life is difficult. Life has full of problems. We can release that in our mindset, guys. When we can feel the freedom, the peace within you. Have a peaceful feelings. Being secure. Feeling safe. Feeling safe in our daily day to day to day life, guys, is freedom. So therefore, you have to acknowledge that you have to decide it for yourself. Actually, that I want to feel free today. I want to feel that freedom today. Release all this anxiety. Release this addiction. Release this anxiety and worries in your heart. Simple as that. Go to God for a word of prayer. Confession is a must to do when you want to feel free with yourself. You don't need to go to church to confess. You can talk with God anywhere and everywhere and even in front of your mirror. It is really very powerful, guys, when you can communicate with God in front of the mirror, talking to Him what you feel, looking eyes to eyes in your face in the mirror. You are communicating with Him. Just do it simple as that and you can feel that you have freedom within your life and you have a peaceful life when you can do it every day. This is Yundel guys. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for joining me here in my life journey. I am very grateful to each and every one of you supporting me here in my channel. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love you all and bye-bye.